Hey everybody, it's Party Elite. Welcome you back to another episode of our Total War Three Kingdoms Records Mode Let's Play as the Kingdom of Chi. This will be another big episode, I think, for us as we go barreling towards the finish line. The Kingdom of Chi grows stronger and stronger day by day. And the Kingdom of Ba is our, of course, our next target. Their seat of power over here, Zhao Di, is just steps away, really, just a handful of seasons away. Uh, Sun Ren, as well as Ken Xiao Xiao, old friends as they are, are looking to uh, use the river. They've been looking to do this for a while. Use the river to gain access to the Kingdom of Ba's territory and uh, push swiftly towards their seat of power and uh, eliminate them and unite all of China under uh, Kong Rong's flag it's uh it's been a long time coming but yes we are at the end game over here some of you have asked why i keep these wars to the uh northwest going why am i quote unquote wasting time with these um it's just that to, just to give you guys some information if you're not already familiar with the channel uh, I like to roleplay as much as possible and try to get into the mindset as much as, pos as possible of the situation at hand and i feel like right now um there's no logical reason to end the war into the north, even though, yes, this campaign is almost over, so to speak. Uh, there's no reason to end the war into the north. We're doing well over here. Momentum is with us. Uh, momentum is with, a, with us over here as well. We've got plenty of armies, so why not keep them going and down south over here as well? At the same time, obviously, we're going to not slow down. We're going to move towards the... Uh, move towards uh, Dao Di here as quickly as possible because we also want to, again, in-universe... Uh, eliminate all the other kingdoms and become the one true emperor to unite China. Uh, up over here, meanwhile, some of you have suggested, and I was thinking this all along, but for some reason I didn't end up doing it, but I absolutely should split this army into parts so they can separate and uh, colonize down south over here. Like, for example, uh, what I think I might do is uh, send Kong Bi on his own a little bit to Kwai Ji and Tian An, and send the other two together down to Dong Wu, uh, and then this uh, area in Tian An as well. Just split them up a little bit. Um, and still keep an eye out for that army that we saw roaming around down over here. Now, all that introductory stuff out of the way, let's go ahead and dive into some early action, and uh, and then we have a little bit of administrative stuff to take care of. Not going to be spending too much money this turn. There are a couple of major fights to be had, though. We're going to be taking the horse pastures over here. Uh, over here, Ma Dai needs to, I think, pull back to help defend uh, her Shuman. Uh, their army versus Ma Dai's army should be an interesting battle. Uh, but first things first, the uh, rebels over here must be taught a lesson. They have gone too far, uh, and their capital is now under siege. We will fight a night battle. The game predicts a valiant defeat, but no. We will crush them, we will destroy their capital, and we will show them that there are consequences for going to war with the Kongs. Yes, indeed, ladies and gentlemen, the consequences of war is what we'll be showing to Fa Tung. Now, this is a massive, massive city, and they do have some of the higher quality troops that we've seen throughout this entire campaign, which is kind of hilarious considering uh, they're just the rebellion faction, but it looks like there's a nice spot over here, perhaps? I recognize this layout a little bit. Uh, we could go up this way, I suppose. They've got... Let's see, if we go up this way, we'd have to crash through this and this and this uh okay or we can go down this tower um hallway tower corridor or we can do this and we only have to smash through one of these to rush through and, and yeah sure let's go ahead and do this uh we'll try and break down the walls maybe over here because i believe that'll give us the best sort of counter to their overlapping yeah they these guys we can ignore you 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 and almost certainly yeah i knew you'd be facing three quarters so okay fine we gotta get rid of one two three four fair enough we've got rank 10 trebuchet hopefully they can do their jobs uh let's go ahead and get set up everybody over here go ahead and get our spears up front of course and they can turtle up and eat the range shots now the thing is so the ai i've seen this question asked often the ai from what i've seen and what i've gathered does not fire archers and crossbows at uh, spear uh, spear guard or anybody who's in turtle formation anybody that has over 100 percent uh um range block chance however towers do um so that's a reason for keeping that's, that's something to keep in mind towers e internal towers or you know wall towers they will fire at uh, at the spear guard even if their block chances are so high so that's something to keep in mind as we move in uh for this and future battles of course 
go ahead and get this all set up. Actually, on the topic of future battles, I just want to mention really quickly that if you have been enjoying this series and you would like to see uh, Total War Three Kingdoms coverage continue on the channel, please do not hesitate to let me know by dropping a like and a comment down below, especially with the new DLC coming out. I do intend to cover it, and it's good to know that you know, how many people are interested, what you might be interested in, if you have any questions specifically, uh, should I get early access, you know, anything I should look out for, anything you guys are wondering, etc, etc, uh, stuff like that, um, and then plus on top of that, of course, I gotta figure out which Warlord I'll be playing as, maybe I'll throw out a vote, uh, or something, I don't know, I don't know, we'll, we'll play it by ear, but definitely going to be covering that on this channel, and, uh, perhaps playing a slightly different kind of a character, so to speak, a different sort of a role, so we can, adopt a more maybe ruthless attitude. I've seen some people request a, a ruthless approach, a one that is more intentionally violent than this one being dragged into wars that we don't necessarily want, uh, or maybe try playing tall again, but actually play tall that time. I don't know. <laughs> let me know. Let me know your thoughts. Uh, for now, let's go ahead and get this started. Uh, first things first, we actually need to put some holes in the walls. So regular shots, make sure everyone's set up right. Yep. Let's begin. Get you guys firing over here and you guys firing over here. That should do the trick. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Want to make sure we're firing. Oh, oh, we're definitely firing. And we're missing a little bit. I don't like that. Alright. Love the sound of the impacts. Hope we don't flub more shots. Come on. Give me, give me, give me some beauty here. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I haven't knocked anybody off yet. Come on, who's... Oh, actually, we have... Oh, I'm wrong. We definitely have our buddy over here. Oh, my God. Okay, I thought he didn't have a top half of his body. Down goes that wall section, and down goes this wall section. All right. So, with all that done, go ahead and get you flaming shots firing up over here. Missed shots will hopefully hit that clump back there. That's a huge clump. And you flaming shots firing over here. Same thing. If missed shots hit those clumps back there, that'll be great. Hopefully we'll get some work done over here. You guys are already firing away. Got to keep an eye on the numbers as well. There we go. Yes, that worked out beautifully. <laughs> I'm not going to complain about that. I love this damage uh, impact on the inside. That doesn't make sense. Ah, uh, science works. All right, in comes some more shots over here. Not really doing the best, but at least we're causing some damage to the troops as well. These guys are moving in over here. Fair enough. Some shots coming in over here as well. Hopefully this will do... I, I mean, I, I can't really complain about that. Very low on ammo, it feels like. This is almost on fire. He's one more good hit. One more good hit. Hold your fire. Get it. Wow, these guys are giving up. That's hilarious. We did not get it, though. Try not to waste ammo here. That's catching fire. Waste some ammo up there. Let's go ahead and turn your attention down to this tower for a second here. And it's still doing fine. I don't like that. Okay, so this thing's going to burn now. Excellent. Lots of clumps over there. These guys, I love that they started giving up already. Are you serious? Okay, there we go. Hey, hold your fire. Um, fire over here, I suppose. Try and get rid of that one. This one should be easy to hit. Yep, looks like it. Then we can start firing at these, like... Well, they've got big clumps. Come on. Really? There we go. Uh, fire at this over here. Good, that tower's going down. Firing over here still. Yeah, got some hits in already. Good stuff. I'll see if we can't uh, scare some of these crossbows off. Scare some of the range units off, basically. And allow our cavalry to come through a bit more easily, perhaps. There we go. Shots coming through. Give me some good hits. Or just disappear into the... What the hell was that? What was those disappearing shots? What is going on with this game? Alright, good hit there, I guess. Good hit there. Oh, great hit there. Nice. The barricade's definitely going to burn out. Okay. Definitely wasted some shots there. Goddamn. Stop paying attention. 
Um, go ahead and fire up over here. Good. This is good. Because then what we can do now is we can also send everybody over here up. Oh, God. The hell? Okay, send you up there. Send you up over here. Don't think we even need to go that close. Uh, Alright, you fire over here. You fire over here. These guys are nicely clumped as well, but our range units should be able to take care of that. That wasn't so good. Trying to run out of ammo. Not very happy about that. Come on, let that volley do some work. Okay, I guess I did a little bit. There we go, there we go. <laughs> Turning on the torches in the city over here. We are within range. Where is my repeating crossbow? Get you to fire at the reclaimers. Safe distance. What's their block chance? 50% for both of these. That's fine. Fire away. Crossbows, baby. Crossbows. What's up? Wow. They are dropping like flies. Despite their block chances, despite their armor and everything. Hey, good stuff. Going very well. Now these guys are going to start responding, of course. But that's okay. Very tempting to actually send my cavalry through, isn't it? Well, over there. These guys are giving up. Let's go ahead and fire the White Wave veterans. Get our repeating crossbows up as well. Might as well at this point. Okay, there we go. These guys should give up pretty soon. Very nice. Turn around and fire over here. Now, these guys have spears as well, the Ringers of Righteousness, so just have to be careful with my cavalry not to send them charging through. On which note, let's bring the cavalry up over here. Okay, turn around and fire over here. Oh. Hope we can make it through. Fire up there. You can charge in there, let's go. Tell me you can make it through. Yeah, looking pretty good. Get you out here as well. These guys are not having a good time. Turn around and fire over here. Let's go. Can you push through? I don't know if they can. By the way, I think we can... Yeah, that thing's been destroyed, so we should be able to do... This. That way, please. Thank you. Yep, we're moving. Alright. Oh, these guys are not having a good time. Let's move up, please. Go, let's go, let's go. Go out of there. Go. All right, we're pushing over here. Being crossbows, as always, suffering a fair bit. Push you through. Fire back over there. A lot of range. Go up there, let's go. Go up there as well, let's go. Get a rear charge over here. Both of you. Go, let's go, let's go. No time to waste. Okay, good charges over here, looks like. Pull you up this way. We'll get some charges into these guys. Up over here, they do have some spears. Reclaimers, in fact. Fine, keep going, keep going. Don't stay back there. Go. And you up there. Pull you off to the side. A lot of ammunition now. Go up in there, let's go. Get you up in here. 
Go up there. Let's go. All right, in we go. Hopefully with some good charges. We're pretty badly hurt on these uh, cavalry units, actually. Got to be careful with that. In we go. Okay, good hits, I think. Yeah, decent hits for sure. Now we can pull back. Back, I said. You ready? Pull you away. Up over here. Alright. Doing alright. We're doing alright. These guys are pulling back. Okay, good stuff. Are we overpowering them over here? Kind of. Yeah, way back, way back. These archers are gonna cause trouble otherwise. Come in here from both sides. This should be painful for them. And we go from one side. And in we come from the other. Not so clean on the other side. But they're shaking, wavering, losing. Come on, give up. Or we get surrounded. Are you up there? Are we going to get a nice charge here? Our men are running. Oh. Excuse me, these are not good charges. There we go. There we go. Pull you back up this way. Pull you back down that way. What are you doing over here? Oh, it's our cavalry that gave up over there. Back a little bit. Hey, get you back in here. They're all rushing here as quickly as possible. Can't blame them. Turn around, get a charge in there. Hopefully they won't brace. Actually, it's going to charge up here. Go, go, go. Go. Those aren't charges. There we go. That's a charge. Okay, well done there. Good damage. Good damage. Pull you away. And charge these guys while they're not braced. Yeah, I'd say we did well there. And then you gotta pull back into safety. Oh, these guys are giving up. Charge up over here. Story, the tale of two generals over here. Guardians of the land, gonna take a fair bit of damage. I'm taking a lot of risks here with these generals. Pull you over here. Okay, we got you coming with the rear charge over there as well. Excellent. Just going to check up on them, so good timing there. Pull you over to here. Pull you over to here. What's the deal back here? Great. Just sitting there eating shots. Love it. Turtle up again. Come on. Close the gap up there. You go up that way, alright. Be out. Be back. Stop paying attention for a second. Oh, let's go. Got this, it's just a matter of uh, not losing anything valuable in the meanwhile. Turn you around, turn you around, let's go. Get these guys off, maybe. Devastating charges there. Still confident and willing to fight. Pull you guys back. Pull you back as well. Going through there. You're going to engage them. You're going to come up this way. Let's go. Come on. Did okay there. Pull back again. Pull over this way. Try and scare these guys off as we're pulling back over here. Come on, in we go. Come on, give up on the fight. Give up on the fight, damn it. Push through, push through, push through. Come over here, get out of there. You guys are not having a good time. Okay, finally. They've given up over there. That's one unit. Take a risk over here. Take another charge. Oh. Keep an eye on them. Make sure they're not uh, braced and ready for eating charges. 
Okay, good. These guys are giving up. Push up this way. Go ahead and get a charge over here. Let's go. Should be a good charge. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on go. Go, go, go. Big old clump over here to hit. Go up there as well. Let's go. Alright, one side solid. Other side... Good stuff. Get you out of there. Guardians of the land. Nice. Pull you back, pull you up as well. Oh, looks like they're giving up. <laughs> okay, we took more losses there than maybe I would have liked to, but a decisive victory nonetheless. Uh, I was a little too focused on, on my cavalry play there, as I, as I tend to be. Uh, I had so many troops just sitting back looking pretty, not doing anything. I guess I just thought it'd be a lot easier to take that town. Uh, I was being a bit cocky there, for sure. For sure. But... Less than a thousand lost. Wiped out the entire enemy army, of course. Let's go ahead and occupy this land. And hopefully these guys have learned a lesson. See, now I wouldn't mind maybe suggesting... Eat. Oh, wow. They just don't know when to call it quits, do they? They just don't know when to call it quits. I have no other options, really. Anywhere else. Um... I can keep the war going. It's not like I'm hurting. It'll take me, what, two turns to replenish these guys to basically full strength. These guys, not so much, but we're ready to roll out. It won't take me very long. And what do they have left? The two armies over here got beaten to a pulp. Still very happy with that defense of ours. Uh, and the two armies further down over here got crushed as well. In this area, I think it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They got crushed as well. So I'm not really all that worried about... Uh, about Tufa Tong. But over here, we do need to roll in and take the horse pasture. So the decision was either pulling back to deal with Han Xin's army or moving in to take the horse pastures and preparing to defend against uh, the almost inevitable attack from Lu Meng. Han Xin has been a thorn for a very long time, so I do want to wipe them out. So uh, let's go ahead and take the horse pastures over here and prepare our defenses. Uh, just to make sure that uh, we're causing as much damage as possible. Decisive victory, low predicted casualties. I might actually auto-resolve that. Uh, let's just delegate that. What will it be, like a couple hundred at most? And prepare for a, a bigger fight to come. Wow, are you serious? I should have fought that myself. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? We'll be fine. We'll bounce back quickly enough. We'll bounce back quickly enough. Never, they say to peace. Never. What can one man do against such reckless hate? Alright, um... Garrison here isn't too pitiful. Upgrade is not an option right now, but... It's a pretty hefty upgrade to troops and stuff. See, here is a problem. This arm... So, the Silk Trader at Wudu... Has an okay garrison. We've got a lot of range, we've got some swords. This army has... Uh, you know what? Actually, no, we should be able to take them defend against them with just what we have at uh, at the Silk Traders. In which case, Ma Dai can do what I was originally planning, which is move uh, against her Shuman over here. This is a two-turn move? Yeah. I don't want to do a force march because I would like to replenish on the way. So let's go ahead and pull as close as possible. Keep the replenishing happening. Yeah, that's good. And uh, next turn we'll get there. Cool. Cool. Um, done, done. Done. Who's left? Right, of course. Down over here, Sunren and uh, and Cao Xiao. Now, well, if I recall correctly, the Kingdom of Ba hid an army in here. So let's go ahead and pay them a visit real quick. Ah, they pulled out of the water. That would have been great, though. Um, bad. I wonder if I can't... Because if we engage, we can just destroy them. I'm not worried about that. I'm worried about... Uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm worried about auto-resolving. Let's go ahead and push up over to here, perhaps? Now let's push up over to here. And take to the land. 
Right, and then over here, Jin Ren can push two turns, that'll be? Okay. Fair enough. Push up to here first. Oh. Oh. Hello. Too bad we can't uh, get onto the land over here. We could get on over here, perhaps? Nah, too far away. Not in position. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Oh, that's too bad. Would have been good to eliminate both of these armies nice and early. And we do have a spy en route to the Kingdom of Ba as well. Uh, hoping to get some eyes before we get too invested and make some wrong moves. But that's that taken care of. We have 14k that I should do something with. 14k. Holy crap. And also very well said about... Uh, I think it was Yanmen, where we were just kind of sitting there collecting all these taxes and the people are suffering, and so up they rise in rebellion, of course. Of course. Taiyuan, perhaps we... What do we got here? We got industry income. Alright, so let's go ahead and give something industrial over here. Uh, ta -ta. How about... Uh, that's just income, private workshops. That gives the boost, mainly for commerce though, so fine. State workshops, and we can move up this chain either direction, maybe reduce the corruption as well, if we ever get there. I don't think we will. Well, actually, unless I do that. Because I have the money. Nice. <laughs> Not that corruption here is probably costing me all that. I mean, you know what, it actually is. And then we can help the adjacent commanderies as of next turn. We have so much money, I can just kind of focus on individual build, uh, individual uh, settlements like that. Okay, I believe that's everything to do right now. Is there... This is all just rebellions, I think. Rebellion imminent at Beihai. Oh. Do that tax exemption. There you go. Hurt me. 10 is mustering. That's fine. Bonghai. What's wrong with you? Low public order, but... Oh, Rebellion's mustering. It's right there. Right. I was like, what? And then who else? Is that it? A couple of Rebellions here and there? Yep. A couple of re Rebellions. There's a bunch of Rebellions falling apart from the inside. Not really. We're okay. We're okay. Let's see what the AI does. Okay. Her Shuman is... Alright, interesting. Wei Wan Su is pulling back towards Tai Shi Tzu. Maybe not intentionally, but it's definitely where they're ending up. Ufa Tong, what are you trying? Just leave. <laughs> Give up. As predicted. That's a little scary. It didn't attack us. It did not attack us. But we should be able to night battle our way through them. Through both of their armies. These guys haven't moved down here either. Alright. Uh... Ooh, Kong Yanzi has been born to Kong Fen and Sun Ren. Joyous occasion, a son has been born. New blood keeps the line strong, but may also give rise to jealousy if other siblings feel their own position is threatened. So that's what they were doing on the uh, the river ride from, from here to here, eh? I see, I see. All right, all right. Uh, okay, one spy returning, another one sent. Wow. Got another full stack back there. Okay, fair enough. Not too worried about that. We'll be okay. Yu Chung is tranquil. Good for you, buddy. How? Amidst all this war? I don't know, but okay. Suffering some attrition up over here, it seems. Suffering a lot of attrition, it seems. Kind of ridiculous amounts of decisive ba defeat, it thinks, but... Uh, I should have fought that previous battle. For sure. I want to pay the price for it now. Close defeat, high predicted casualties. We can't have that happen. To the battlefield we go... Let's uh, fling Hansen back. All right, folks. I think we'll be fine. This is also very interesting terrain. Very different from uh, what I'm used to fighting on, I guess. What, what is this? A very, <laughs> a very nice place to live, it looks like. All right, but we've got this nice little defendable area over here. Go ahead and pull everybody back. We do have two trebuchet that we can pull uh, like so... Like, so I do like the crossfire. It does help a fair bit. Go ahead and get all of you set up like so. Well, box you up a little bit. Also helps a fair bit. 
Okay, there we go. Our spears. This doesn't actually block us. Oh, I guess we've sallied forth into the enemy camp, I suppose. Oh, we don't have... Yeah, we do. It's just these guys don't. These guys have this instead. That reduces their block chance. Right. Go ahead and get you guys set up like so. Pull you over there. Pull you two over here. Get our swords right behind over here like so, I think. Should be fine. There we go. And then our cavalry. Yeah, I really should have fought that previous battle myself. Should have known. Should have known. Yeah, we'll come in from over here. Definitely, there's definitely a line over here. We just can't see it because of this mound, I think. Um, no big deal. Just have to be very careful with this battle. Not to overextend myself. Make sure I'm fighting in the right directions at the right times. Alright. Ready? I think so. Let's begin. Fire up there and fire over here. If we can scare some of those archers off right at the start. They have a trebuchet. Oh dear. I didn't even catch that. We should fire at that first. Come some early shots. Good hits over there. Come their own shots. That's pretty cool. The fly to the rocks meeting in the middle. Okay, okay. I feel like I should split my troops up a little bit. I don't know how wise it is to go trebuchet versus trebuchet. Seems not very. Wasting ammo. Let's pull over there. And, uh... Firing over here. Let's get you firing over here. Yeah, that was a waste. You guys are now firing at us. Alright, up there, let's go. Formation, let's go. Archers firing over here. Let's go. Push you over this way. Pull you over this way as well. Fire up over... No, no, no. Keep firing there. You fire over here. Our axes are coming through. Ahead. A decent charge over here. Pull you down this way. Good charge over there. Okay, excellent. Good work over here. Let's pull you away. Trying to eat some charges. Let's fire away over here. Are we still getting some work done? Looks like. Then you in. You down there. Keep pulling you away. Let's turn you around this way. Let's go. I believe I didn't see that they had the trebuchet. <laughs> hey, good hits over here. Hey, good stuff. These guys are running. Let's go ahead and fire up over here with you. Actually, fire back over here. Pull you through. Let's go. Get charge back there. Get charge over here. Let's pull you up this way. Let's go. Done well to hold over there. Archers are firing away. Let's go ahead and fire over here. Okay, somewhat decent. Pull you up this way. Try and get some rear charges. Pull you up that way. Actually, no, let's pull you up this way. You're done over there. Let's pull you here. Let's go ahead and get you out of there. Go, bud. Let's go. Okay, good work there. Enemy unit flees. I don't want that friendly fire. It's probably not a good idea to hit my own troops, you know. Oh, wait, hold on. Back on your equipment. Back on your equipment. Fire away. There we go. Get you out of there. Let's go. Trying to give up on the fights. That's good. Go ahead and get you up over here. Get you moving down this way. Let's get you down. Come on, come on, come on. A lot of ammo over here. Get a good rear charge there. We'll do the trick. Putting a good rear charge here does the trick. Let's go ahead and pull you guys around. Okay, in we come. Yeah, that's definitely helping. Ah, 
on out, hold. Be back out, get you up over here. Alright, enemies running, let's go. Firing up there, get you firing. Oh well, let's keep pulling you back down here. These guys look like they're trying to come back. Come on, Yuanzi. Survive, you must. Oh no, 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 Guo Tu, you're my Guo Tu guy, you can't die. Pull him back. Okay, good charges over here. Getting some of them to break, pulling you back still. Send you up. An okay over here, firing away up there still, yep. That's not good. Go on, keep going, keep going. You guys out of here. Can we come get a nice charge in there perhaps? Get you firing up there. They're clumped up nicely still. Giving up. We're starting to give up a little bit. Oh, we're going to eat a charge over here. Pearl Dragons, come on. You can do well here. Good rear charge there. A lot of that situation. Ah, flopping shots over here. Get in there. Pull you back a little bit. Come on, come on, we got this. We got this. We got this. Yeah, we've got this. Hit a hefty toll. Giving up. That's right. And the sword's up. Loop you back around, get another charge in there. Loop you back around, get you in there. Let's get you up here. Yeah, these guys are gonna give up now. On that charge, I imagine. Yep, there it is. And let's pull you around this way. For that. Oh, nah, they've given up. Okay. That was, uh, that was something. That was definitely something. Offensive is what it was. Yuan Zi. How could you? How could you betray your men and leave the battlefield like that? You know better than that. The question is, can we give chase to anything? Not so much should we, because of course we should, but can we? Cavalry took a pretty hefty beating there. Try and get uh, this gap over here closed. Maybe eliminate some of these G militia over here. I think for the most part, these guys have been well taken care of. As long as that trebuchet was destroyed. Oh, I don't know. Maybe the trebuchet actually made it. That would that would be unfortunate. That threw me off my game plan, I think. Okay, in we go. Sure, I mean, hit either of them. Hit both of them. Why not? Just don't stop hitting either. Come on. Okay, in we go. Nice, nice, nice. Loop up over here real quick. Rather, like, eliminate both than eliminate one and leave the other alive. I think they're both taken care of. And that one's definitely taken care of. There's, like, one guy left. I th oh, take that back. All right, last unit to take care of over here. And then we'll call it a battle. Yeah, this was maybe a little bit pricier than, uh... Than I should let it be. That one dude... Is, like, getting ahead of himself. And he's like, wait, guys, are you coming? No, they're not coming. Now they're here. Alright. Unit gone. Claim that victory. Pyrrhic, I imagine. Close. Okay, better than I expected. I'll take it. Lost a lot of men. But yeah, it looks like we did actually eliminate the trebuchet. It only got 82 kills compared to our superior trebuchet technology, of course. Hey, okay, down you go. Wow, lost 500. Yikes. Hang Tong, a level 4. That's not bad. And there's that robe of the omen maker I was talking about earlier. Someone has half of that set. Incompetent? That's hilarious. Okay, well, you... Ang Tong, we will employ. And Tun Yu Sang, you know what? How much trouble could you cause me? Yeah, be gone. Leave me be. Let's go ahead and take the replenishment over here. Yeah, send both of them back a little bit. They might come back. 
but even one turn of replenishment would be would be good for me. Yeah, I think I'll be fine here. Over here, meanwhile, looks like they decided not to come through. What I could do is... Oh, are they encamped? They are, aren't they? God damn it, I hate dealing with encampments. Well, I mean, I could probably... Hmm. Because now I'm wondering if I want to pull back up this way to try and help uh, Fu Pang's army over here. Or do I go chasing for glory? I could crush. Could crush either of these armies. No, wait, that's that's not the garrison. Oh wow, the thing needs to be repaired, right? I don't want to give this up without a fight. Maybe we stay put. What are the chances they come back at us, right? And even if they do, they don't have half the troops. Yeah, yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. What am I pondering? Down over here, Lu Su. Hopefully you're able to get that back soon. I mean, you will. One more turn of replenishment, and then we can crush these guys. Maybe they'll attack us. Either way, I'll, I think I'd rather sally forth and get rid of this little force. Um, and over here, so as a result of those decisions, I think we can, in fact, pull you up to here. Not... Okay, if I push you in here, I don't think I can. Oh, no, I can't. That's really kind of annoying, but it's okay. It's fine. You stay put. We'll attack them. They'll probably be driven back out of fear. Over here, we can crush Wei Wan Chu's army. I think that's the right call over here. No reason not to. Probably going to auto-resolve this if they don't run away, but they, of course they will. Oh, wow. Is this army even going to be standing next turn? I mean, look at that attrition. It might not be. Okay, that's that taken care of down over here, meanwhile. Let's go ahead and... Uh, uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, so Kong B. You. The brother of mine. Going to head up this way. These two, the bickering companions... Taking it a little carefully, just want to see what's going on as well before I rush into something. A bit of a surprise. Okay, in we go. It looks like we're home free here. Good stuff. And then down over here, of course, where's the Kingdom of Ba? Now, this army did not move or anything. We are almost at full strength. They have a lot of archers. We don't have any cavalry in this army, actually. Hmm. Over here, these guys pulled back, or did they go into ambush stance? Either way, we're going to have to make landfall. Let's see if we can't pull off an ambush. Over here, I'm wondering if I want to take on this fight. That's a lot of range. Because my other option is, yes, to actually pull off an ambush. Or set up an ambush. I can't say I'll pull it off. Try it. Uh, of course. Wow. Okay. A little angry at myself. That was all me. That was all my fault. Alright, up over here. Dolgong. Let's go ahead and pull you. This is really abandoned. Wow. Let's keep our eyes on the prize. Head down south with you as well. I'd like to focus on the Kingdom of Ba a little bit. Again, we're close to the end of this campaign, so let's not uh, dally too much. Okay, we're fine. Down over here. We can get that upgrade going. Still only making 13k. Disappointment, disappointment. You're being repaired. Back over here, you're fine. Over here, oh wow, lots of things to replace over here. Here, let's do that. 
I actually can't convert at this level. I mean, I can demolish this anyway. I do want something else. We've got enough food. More than enough food. Go ahead and convert you, sure. Demolish you. What do we do here? Do we have to downgrade you? I'm guessing it's because I don't have the technology to do that level. I could just downgrade. Unless I'm going to get strategic fortresses soon, which I don't think I will. I'm pretty that sounds like something that's very far away from me. Yeah, that's uh that's far away. And turns away. I mean I guess I could wait that long. Let's downgrade it. See if that'll give us an option. If not, then I'm not gonna downgrade it further. Alright, I think we're fine. Um God, it's so tempting to to just chase after something. No, 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 we're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. Alright, I believe that's the turn. Not much else to do or worry about. Uh Bay High, what we can do is we can actually start taxing you again, I believe. Yeah, good stuff. Make some more money, up to 14k again. I had to, I had to figure out something to do with all this money. Oh, ambush stance down south there. Okay, interesting. Like down over here, Hershuman. These guys are moving in as well. It is some pretty big stacks for some very small nations. Pulling back, Hansen. Pulling back over here as well. Coward. Foolish, foolish cowards. Picked a fight with the wrong Kong. Okay, Kingdom of Ba moving through the waters here. Okay. I wouldn't mind, like, chasing after those armies and crushing them in the river. That's just it. I can do that. Rebellion imminent at Yangyang. Okay, that's not so good. I can give them the tax exemption, I suppose. Um, you know, why not? Uh, why not? We've got money. And really, isn't that what matters most? There we go. We got so much money. Losing a fair bit of it now. We went from 14k to 11k. I'm guessing that's because of... What? Hmm, not sure. Young Rose, understanding. We got a brown thoroughbred. Nothing there that should cost us. Oh, oh, I guess, right, the building changes that happened uh, up in this area. All right, fair enough, whatever. Now, where did that one army go? Somewhere, hiding somewhere over here. Get back to the water. Do I just rush? Go. Ambush stance over here, see what they try, if anything. Alright, that's that taken care of, and up over here now. I'm ready to roll out now, right? I can go and chase after these guys. They'll almost definitely surrender. Over here, the garrison is meh. Okay. These guys, unfortunately, will be able to replenish, I think, once they get back into home territory. They do have another army coming as well. So let's go ahead and crush these guys, if possible. Yes, we need to do a little bit more replenishing, but I think we're capable enough of getting rid of this small nuisance. They'll probably retreat because they're cowards. Yep. But they can't retreat far enough. Decisive victory, predicted casualties low. I don't know. I don't trust that. The way the game spreads out these casualties is not favorable. And plus, we've got a pretty important character in this battle. So let's go ahead and dive on in and uh, teach Ma Tao a lesson in defeat. All right. Hopefully we'll make this a swift one. Hopefully too many of our men do not need to fall today. Oh, there we go. You guys are the front line, boxed up. Get you over here, get you over here. Again, get them into formation at the end, because they are otherwise weaker to uh, range fire. Go ahead and get you set up. All right, let's do that. Go all the way over here. Pull you to like that. There we go. Happy enough with how that worked last time, I think, though I didn't keep paying attention to my swords. There we go. There we go. Let's get you up over here. These guys are still a little hurt, which is unfortunate. 
And let's be a bit more careful with our cavalry this time as well. All right, let's get you over here. Good enough for me. Let's get you grouped up and you grouped up as well. Flaming shots, of course. And let's begin and fire away. All right. This should be nice. Nice and easy. Like a bit of a nightcap. Oh, come on. Come on, come on. Get at least one volley before they... I said nice and easy. Why are you making this difficult for me? <laughs> there we go. These guys should be out in the open for a little bit longer. Rather than hiding in these shrubs. In come the shots. It's cold winter night. I'm sure they'd appreciate the heating. I wonder how hot one of those flaming, like... Pots or whatever it is. Wow. Wow, they're so fighting. <laughs> For a hit like that, I feel like giving up. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Good shots, good shots. The buddy over here confidently marching through. Relatively confidently. Oh, no, he's confident. Good hits. Oh, looks like they're closing the gaps. Hit you up that way. Bring you up over here. Very nice. Fire over here real quick. Yeah, these guys are going to start running soon, I hope. There we go. Archers are firing away now as well. I'll let them spread their fire. Nice, very nice. The, wow, I guess a stray shot took Han Sin and so Ma Tao got really upset. They were oath sworn too. Okay, well. Here, I'll take you out of your misery, buddy. How about that? As always, I love seeing cavalry drop to range fire. Oh, it's such a beautiful sight. Such a beautiful sight. Like, not in real life, obviously. I mean, in the video game. Very well animated. Oh, he still stands. Don't let him get away. Looks like he's going to get away. Wow, some serious plot armor over there. Can I charge over here? Counter charge, I say. I stopped paying attention. I'm well aware of what I did there. These guys should all be wiped out more or less entirely. Fire up there. These guys are going to give up as well. There it is. There's the V. All right. Decisive victory. Didn't want to chase them around. They're going to get destroyed anyway. Because they did retreat like cowards. Wonder if uh, Buddy's dead. Those were a lot of arrows that he managed to dodge. Lost only 32. Unfortunate, but hey, it's the cost of doing battle. And uh, we will take the replenishment. Uh, down they go, I guess. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Rushing back is maybe not a terrible idea. I'm not in a rush actually, so that's fine down over here We saw the ambush get set up over here, so we're not about to do anything foolish Tempting to step out and set up an ambush of our own, but nah, we'll just let them attack us And then I think we'll sally forth. We've got the uh, the size of the army that we need over here Meanwhile, they are still encamped But I wonder if they'll retreat if I attack over here and then that'll give me a chance to uh, to roll this army Yep Oh, yeah Oh, yeah, and we're going to roll them hard. Up over here, meanwhile, though, I just want to do a double check. Yeah, we should be able to crush these guys as well. Roll up. And hopefully they have nowhere to retreat to. Of course they do. Right in that little corner. Can't chase them. Wish they would just hurry up and die. That's that. This is this. Uh, down over here. Go ahead and claim some more territory. Regular stance, let's get you in there. Establish order. Not all that expensive or anything. Get you... 
Down over here. Establish order. That was a bit more pricey. Okay. By Z, let's go ahead and get some stuff going on over here. All right. Well, hold on. Here. There we go. There we go. Finally happening. All right. Um, so down here where we right, we're waiting on the enemy uh, over here. We can move. Can we take that livestock farm right now? No. Could take the toolmaker. A little bit of a distraction en route. Oh, what do you know? I don't have the money. To check that first. Do I want to wait until the next turn? Or could I cancel that and this? I hope we haven't like used up our movement points. I feel like we have. The game likes to do that. Yeah, we have. All right, fair enough. Screw it. That's what we get for getting distracted. What we get. Go ahead and build you up. Go ahead and build you up. All right, good stuff. Uh, so yeah, this is all done. Up over here, this work needs to be done. Should be a pretty fun battle. Uh, let's see, we're fine up there. We're fine down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This should be a pretty fun battle because we've got a lot of cavalry, very little range. Everyone can Vanguard deploy. Over here, they've got a fair bit of range. Some spears should be able to roll them. But, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to save that rolling for next session. Leave it on a bit of a cliffhanger. Because who knows? It could go terribly. And then this army is right back there to cause us some trouble. But we'll see if that's what happens or if things go quite well next time. I hope you guys enjoyed this session. If you did, you know what to do. Drop a like, drop a comment. Let me know you would like to see more Total War Three Kingdoms on this channel. As always, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis. And a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time, cheers.